The courses provided to the trainees refer to command team and boarding team separately due to their specific roles and responsibilities in a maritime interdiction operation. The command team is educated by subject matter experts in detail applying NATO doctrines and MEO procedures in an effective and efficient way through classroom indoctrination. For these modules, it is aimed that the Chinese will improve their knowledge about basic concept upon which MIIs are based on, command and control relationships and responsibilities in MIO as well as composition of command, boarding and ship control teams. Lessons learned from previous and ongoing MIOs such as Operation Active Endeavour, Unifil and Sharp Guard, Comprehension and drafting of MIO-related messages, especially Optask MIO and Optask MIO SUP. The most relevant MIO intelligence tools such as Bright and AIS. The main capabilities and usage methods of specific air assets such as MPAs, helicopters, UAVs in support of MIOs. When a boarding team comes here, we first teach them the theoretical background and safety precautions of each module and then we proceed to the actual practical training, which is adjustable to their capabilities and their training requirements. By these modules, it is aimed that the trainees will improve their skills and knowledge on actions other than tactical sweep on board a suspect vessel from embarkation through to handover to a ship control team, documentation and certification that have to be inspected on every merchant vessel in accordance with IMO regulations, the difficulties and dangers that they may encounter during cargo inspection on different types of merchant vessels, and getting familiar with combat stress factors and the way to recognise physical and mental symptoms of combat stress. For these modules, it is aimed that the trainees will improve their skills and knowledge on climbing techniques and opening methods on a stack of containers, the dangers that they may encounter during container inspection operations and the safety measures that need to be followed in order to execute this kind of operation. Skills necessary to use firearms, primary weapons and secondary weapons in confined spaces. We do this by using weapons that fire marking cartridges. Skills necessary to safely approach, neutralise and secure crew of a suspect vessel. Basic techniques on how to manoeuvre and approach a suspect vessel by using rigid hull inflatable boats, skills necessary to perform fast rope insertion, and skills necessary to conduct boarding operations under multiple threats such as booby traps, CBN material existence. In 4000 series, the naval units participate in the Open Seas final tactical exercise where MIO related scenario is conducted. Prior to open seas, boarding team personnel practice visit board, search and seizure scenarios on the mock-up ship Aris. During open seas, command team and boarding team are evaluated with a score checklist on their ability to plan and execute MIO in accordance with NATO doctrines and procedures, as well as the eligibility of the ship organization and the condition of ship's equipment related to MIO.